the Dal Lake, the second largest lake in Kashmir, as Dayak. This fabled lake appears strangled by growing piles of duckweed, water ferns, and algae. The color of the lake's water has changed from bluish green to hazel due to higher turbidity. The water is unfit for drinking and aquatic life is also under constant threat due to depletion of dissolved oxygen. The JNK Pollution Control Board had drawn attention in a report in 2009 about the gradual but unchecked degradation of the Tal Lake and states that the lake pollution is largely caused by the houseboats which have been traditionally tourist favorites. The research shows 1200 houseboats alone dump about 9,000 metric tons of waste into the lake each year. Fifteen major drains get emptied into the lake, bringing along 18.2 tons of phosphorus and 25 tons of inorganic nitrogen nutrients. Besides nitrates and phosphates, about 80,000 tons of silt get deposited in the lake every year. Over the years, the conservation efforts have witnessed significant progress. Yet there is a lot to be done. There is a need to take substantial measures to restore the ecosystem of the lake and preserve its unique biodiversity. According to loud officials, the two kilometer stretch from the Dal to Nishat pipeline bund is always the worst hit by the red algal bloom during summer. The high temperature increases the growth of red algae, which feed off the nutrient content in the lake. The excavation of weeds is being done manually and by huge machines. Manual cleaning of the lake provides employment to hundreds of dull devilers. The emphasis is laid on calia, lily pads, creepers, algae, water plants, and other waste materials. The manual cleaning yields good results as the workers uproot the weeds, while the machines cut only the upper portion of the weeds. The need of the R is to save the lake from dying.